Childhood obesity is a special focus of Workout Wednesday this year. Chef Mark Mullentine caters to some pretty special kids in Kansas City, helping them make healthy choices. This Workout Wednesday, we are following in his footsteps. Okay, so yeah, we're really trying to change people's palates. There's no slowing down on Chef Mark's tour. He's on the fast track at Children's Mercy Hospital, showing us the top five healthy changes here at the hospital that we can also try at home. Number one, watch what you're drinking. You won't find a sugared beverage in this hospital. We've just recently gone from a 2% milk to a 1% milk, and I haven't heard, I haven't heard a word about it. Tip number two, portion control. So we won't find a 32 ounce cup in this place or a 64 ounce big gulp kind of, th kind of thing in here. On to the sandwiches and tip number three, reduce unnecessary fats. We have a typical panini, but instead of spraying it with you know oils and that type of thing or butter and then putting it on the grill, we have these bags that we take the, the product into with no extra fat. We, we put it in the bag and we put the bag on the panini grill. Even the ranch dressing had a fat reducing makeover, and I think it was good. This is actually the ranch dressing packet and non fat, non flavored yogurt. That's it. Chef Mark put Children's Mercy on the cutting edge, leading the way as hospitals across the country jump on the bandwagon, exchanging unhealthy foods for healthy options. He thought patients and customers would object, but only a handful pushed back. They understand this is a hospital, and Food in the hospital should be healthier if it's not anywhere else in the world. It should be in a hospital. That's why the days are numbered for deep fat fryers. This time next month, they'll be kicked out of every Children's Mercy Hospital kitchen. From now on, fries will be cooked in giant convection ovens that don't require fat. We have parfaits, but they're made with a low-fat yogurt. You want some fruit? Here's grapes. Changes like kicking out regular chips for baked chips didn't happen overnight. And that's tip number four. Make healthy changes slowly. It's like working out. You work out a little bit every day, which is better than working out a lot for two weeks and giving up. Finally, Chef Mark's tip number five is try something new. If you're going to put 10 things in your grocery cart, find two of them that are different than the 10 things that you normally buy. Making sure it's low fat, low sugar, and fresh food over frozen. Now, Chef Mark offers the same healthy menu for his young patients in the hospital at Children's Mercy. If you know an inspiring adult or child fighting childhood obesity, message me on Facebook or send me an email. And remember, invite me to your workout.